Hi guys, Sandra Rains the Bus, Sasquatch Girl and author. Um, <clears throat> I just shared a story with you, my near death experience, and now I, and my whole intention to begin with was sharing something else, but I got off track, which I do often because I have racing thoughts. Anyway. I had to answer somebody on messenger but uh okay <clears throat> I've always told my kids I've always told everybody because I remember it vividly I remember before I was born um, it's not a elaborate story but I can tell you exactly what I remember I remember sitting in this black void beside a boy and it's not that I could see this boy I just knew it was a boy and I had no body um, he had no body we were spirits only and from what I remember even though we had no body I remember kneeling and looking down this open space out of this black void and seeing a hospital below and I knew what was happening in that hospital um, and I, I knew there was a two women in this room and uh, the boy beside me was the baby still in the belly of the mother on the left or right in the bed and my mom was on the left in the bed And behind me, above me, around me, came a man's voice. And he said, which one will go? And the next thing I remember was, you know, being here, being born. And my mother told me, well, when I told her, when I was able to talk and I told her what I remembered before I was born, she said that the girl on the, in the right side of the, you know, in the right bed, on the right, uh, lost her baby. It was born dead. And it was a boy. And mom said that she felt so sorry for her. So I can only assume that that boy that died <clears throat> was the boy spirit that was beside me in this black void. And maybe it's something that we decided on, myself and this boy spirit, that I would live and he would wait. You know, I don't know. But I do remember that vividly, and I do remember the voice that spoke to us. Um, anyway, that's my, that's the story I intended to share with you when I did the near death. But I can share a lot of things with you, and I think I'm going to. Because not only does it do me good to talk about it, um, it lets you know who I am, what type of person I am. Now, I know I'm going to get these trolls that tell me how stupid I am or how my video sucks because that's what they do for a living. 
for entertainment, but I'm going to share it anyway. You know, there's no shame in my game. So, peace out, guys. Love you all.